I'm doing this recording because uh, over here for about a good 45 minutes now, the first time I went over there 45 minutes ago, maybe a little over an hour ago, should I say, uh, I was uh, standing there talking with Mustafa and the other security guard. Next thing I know, there they go woof, right out the door after two skateboarders. And they literally got in their face. Yeah. And I guess the skateboard was threatened upon them. So I showed them a little technique about how to snatch the skateboard away from the guy if he does it. And uh, I think next time it happens, they're going to use it. But the skateboarders were, I think, were maced. And honestly... That's not against the law. Um, these skateboarders around here are rude as hell. They don't care. I'm the type of person I believe in the right thing. And so is my wife. If I see something wrong, I'm going to talk about it. I'm done wrong, I'm going to tell about it. These skateboarders around here just don't care. There's a big few are that are respectful. <coughs> and uh, if you tell them or yell out, hey, respect, please. They'll simply call out, I apologize, ma'am. But there are those, if you yell it out, they're going to say, F you. We'll do what we want. I'm going to show you guys something. Right there, at that edge, right beyond those trees, that's the police car. The officer is inside the Safeway right now, talking with uh, Mustafa and the other security guard. So, you know, that's, and the two guys that they were talking to, or should I say the officer was talking to, was on the sidewalk. So, be careful who you hang out with and be careful of your attitude. Because you never know what you're going to run into. Because you never know what you're going to run into, exactly. There are people out there, especially these youngsters, they just don't care. And I know if there's any elderly that watches this video, these videos, they know what I'm talking about. They're rude, mouthy, think they know it all. Every cuss word in the book. Say every cuss word in the book, even words you probably never heard of. <laughs> And all you could do is look at them like, mm -hmm. what? They just don't care. What did you just say? They just don't care. What um, what kind of word did you just tell me? What, what kind of curse word is that? <laughs> <laughs> but everything's gonna be all right. <laughs> No, that's not my real singing voice, trust me. If I really wanted to, I could sing. But I told I told the guards to go ahead and send the officer over here that I actually saw mostly what happened, if not all of it. And these boys literally got in their face. In the security guard's face. They didn't care. They thought, oh, okay, yeah, go ahead. And then the other guy threatened to bring a gun out? Seriously?
I'm surprised these boys didn't get put in the back of the police car and be taken to jail right now. But I think the cop released them. You never know. I just don't know anymore these days. It's just... Like they always say, you win some and you lose some. In this case, it was a 50-50 situation in this one. It was a win-lose situation on both accounts. <laughs> But according to them, I think charges were both filed on both accounts, on the guards and on the people who tried to assault them. It's okay, though. It's okay. Here's a little input for all the youngsters out there. You may think you have an educational background. Let me tell you something. Never underestimate someone, especially if they're elderly. I have seen some elderly come down and whoop butt on some youngsters now. But you've got to understand, kids. Just because you're young and you think you can fight, it don't mean not a doggone thing. <clears throat> Under these circumstances, the older ones are starting to fight back. So don't underestimate them. Especially if they're vets. But I'm gonna go ahead and cut it for right now. And I'm gonna see if this officer comes over here in just a few minutes. If he does, uh, I will try and film it. Because I want you youngsters to see that it's not all peas and carrots. It's not, it's not like Forrest Gump. Jenny, we're lot pies and carrots. <laughs> Life's like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. <sighs> but anyway, guys, I'm going to let you go. Take it easy. Yeah, you better let him go.